Unlikely Heroes is a group of artists that were brought together by Greg Nelson, who goes by the artist pen name Yo Asakura, and Connie Walker, also known as Neo Anime Girl. For years, they have been studying the manga, anime, comic, and movie entertainment scenes in detail from times of old. Each member was one of those draws on their homework all the time students you may have known back in school. Anime and manga are a culture. Comics and cartoons are a culture. The reason many cannot replicate the styles of traditional manga is because of many different aspects of the genre that have been lost to time. Unlikely heroes, with their array of talents, believed to have found the solution. The members of Unlikely Heroes have been situated in South Florida for over 20 years each, with the exception of 30 years for two of them. They are very familiar with what's in within their city, and when it comes to what's liked and what's eagerly waiting to be discovered by hungry anime enthusiasts that long for the styles of old. They have a list of accomplishments to date that can demonstrate some of their prowess. Unlikely Heroes was first formed by Greg Nelson and Connie Walker in 2012. The initial reason for the meeting was to find a suitable manga and anime artist that would be most beneficial in manga production. All expectations were met and more. They came to the mutual agreement of a place where they could sell their artworks to an audience that was receptive of this style of art in particular, an anime convention. Yo did not know much about anime conventions, but with the help of Neo Anime Girl, they presented their art at Supercon and won over so many people. Yo had the opportunity to walk down the artist aisle and view the artwork of other artists. He could pinpoint everything they did right, the things they got wrong, and paid extra attention to how people presented themselves and their art. All the knowledge they accumulated only fueled their desire to do even better at the next Supercon. Since 2012, Unlikely Heroes have had an artist table every year at Supercon and could never be more thankful for the opportunities it has presented. For example, since first appearing at Supercon 2012, they have attended conventions outside of Florida upon requests as guests for their manga production and cosplay presentations. They have produced and distributed an original story in manga format with pages exceeding 18 to 22 per week for a period of six months successfully and have built a following based on this original story and content they have created. They have become published manga artists with Phoenix Dreams Publishing in June 2017. They have held fashion and swimsuit shows based on video game content and media with full cooperation from outstanding figures in the cosplay community. And they have provided anticipation from and for actual celebrity guests that attend super convention events, including but not limited to Miley Flanagan, the voice of Naruto Uzumaki, who is also awaiting Yo's next project, a number of Dragon Ball Z voice characters have recognized them for their DBZ cosplay and dubbing Yo's Piccolo cosplay the most flawless they have ever seen. Special Beam Cannon! <laughs> the entire cast of Attack on Titan, Steven Bloom, and every voice character in Steven Universe for Yo's Jasper cosplay. Most of all, they are eager to pass down their knowledge to others because they did not get successful on their own. In time, they aim to have a full-fledged animation and production studio that they will be able to fully utilize, create, and produce animation and media 
that will touch the minds and hearts of those in the Florida manga and anime community and hopefully spreading even further. Imagine an animated series that's anticipated and asked specifically about at conventions. Or maybe a play that will help audiences understand video games on devices that may be a bit too complicated for them. Or perhaps to simply create an anime that would be watched and related to by hundreds. Unlikely heroes can create it. Their main goal is to create a place where all art is concentrated and produced for businesses, schools, associations, even music videos for aspiring music artists. This dream can easily become reality, and it starts with bringing everyone together. They are a group of serious individuals that have a vast knowledge of the anime and manga culture and match wits with the best of them. They are all dedicated to restoring and upholding the true nature of how animation was presented in the prime of its time, considered to be the 90s and later. Unlikely heroes give off that old adult swim feel from the early 2000s. They have many manga series in production that reflect diversity as well and go the extra mile to perfect the anatomy of the characters to fully show each individual culture appropriately. Even in the darkest light, heroes need for their people to believe in them. It starts with showing them that there is something or someone to believe in.